Shalom. I want to say all praises to Yahweh. Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai. Ba'ashem Raka Kodash. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone. And Shalom to all of Akim pushing this word in our sincerity and truth. This is Kazakh from GMS Jamaica. And um, <coughs> we just want to get into a very short and hopefully edifying lesson on, on the whole Jesus only slash God the Father, God the Son um, doctrine. Right? And um, I'm not really do, I'm going to try, Lord willing, if you not do too much commentary on this one and just let the scriptures speak. Because the scriptures that I'm about to read, they are very straightforward. Right? Them show you that look, two different beings seen. Um, so, without further ado, this is First Timothy 2 and 5. For there is one God and one mediator between God and men, the man, Yahweh Shai Hamashayak. See? <clears throat> so this, so um, the first, pre right off the bat, the first precept will tell us, look, there is one God and there is one mediator between God and men, which is Yahweh Shai. So this first precept I'm going to read, dif uh, already starting to differentiate um, the most I from the sun seen um, this this next scripture is Daniel 7 and 13 I saw in the night visions and behold <coughs> one like the son of man which speaking of Yahweh Shai whom the world ignorantly call Jesus, or Jesus Christ, seen. One like the Son of Man came with the clouds of heaven and came right, and came to the ancient of days and they brought him near before him. Seen. So again, this is differentiating the Heavenly Father from Yahweh Shai. Right? It says, <clears throat> again, I'm going to read it. Um, I saw in the night visions, and behold, one like the Son of Man, which is Yahweh Shai, with the cloud, came with the clouds of heaven, them chariots, and came to the ancient of days, which is the Most High, seeing um, name, his name being Yahweh, came to the ancient of days, and they brought him near before him. Right, so the angels brought the Lord Yahweh Shai to the Father, which is Yahweh. Seeing again, it's differentiating that's two different people. Seeing that's two different beings, I should say. Seeing, <coughs> right, it didn't, it is no way, no way, it no way, it is saying that um, the Most High. Um, the angels brought the Mosai to himself. No. See? Um, next scripture. Next scripture. Um, this, this one is all the way seen way back, throwback, seen in the history. See? This is from 2 Samuel. 2 Samuel chapter seven and verse twelve verse twelve right verse twelve and when the days when thy days be fulfilled and thou shalt sleep with thy fathers I will set up thy seed after thee which shall proceed out of thy bowels and I will establish his kingdom speaking of Solomon which um, which we being learned know that look um, Solomon seen reincar was reincarnated as Yahweh Shai right um, Yahweh Shai basic, is basically from the lineage of David right 
um, the Lord, the Most High, does not have a lineage. The Most High is the Ancient of the Days, meaning he has no beginning and he has no end. Right? Yahweh Shai has a beginning and he has an end. See? He, be, um, he began as the Word in the beginning. See? Then him come as Adam. Right? Seen years past him come as him come as um, Isaac, years past him come as Solomon, seen years past and him come back as himself. Seen as he, yeah, as himself, yeah, how was I? Seen. Um continuing, he shall build an house for my name, and I will establish the king the, the throne of his kingdom forever. I will be his father, and he shall be my son. If he commit iniquity, I will chasten him with the rod of men and with the stripes of the children of men. See? <clears throat> right? So this, this is an straightforward precept again. Right? If for those who understand reincarnation, see, this is speaking of Solomon which is Yahushai, right? And it's also a prophecy, seen because Solomon was not, was not, um, was not chastened, seen all the days of his life, right? There, he had peace until the day he died, right? There was peace with Solomon until the day he died, right? Now he had to come back as Yahushai to suffer for his, <coughs> for his crimes, for his iniquities, Seen. We, so basically that um Yahusha is not the most I himself, right? Reincarnated, um basic we basically come down in a flesh. No. Seen. That that are the that are the most Yahusha is the most I's right hand man. Basically. Him only begotten son. Not him not him himself, yo. Know? Right. There is nothing that man can do to get the most I feel left him thrown to come down upon earth, right? For sacrifice himself for men. See, furthermore, the most I does not even doesn't even like um the most I despise flesh. See, that is why I'm kill um people daily, right? The most I has no regard for flesh. He has regard in regards to the spirit. See. Um, right, and you have many other precepts, right? We 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 go in and show you that look, the Lord and the Father are two different beings. Seen, um, yeah, seen. So, brothers, anybody can come on the comment board and uh, drop some more of these precepts under this video. Seen for edification sake. See, because me know, me know, um, me have, I have more precepts, but um, for time, I'm just gonna leave some of the. I'm gonna read one, I'm gonna read one more. I'm gonna read the last one. See, this is uh, all right. Okay, yeah. This is Psalms 2. Hold on, give me a second there. Okay, Bible. Okay, this is Psalms 2 and verse. And verse uh, 8. See? Hold on, hold on. Okay, yeah. Psalms 2 and verse 7. Right? I will declare the decree. Yahweh hath said unto me, Thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee. See? 
um, we all know that a lot of prophecies will get uh, written in the Psalms scene are written about Yahushai, which is the son of the Most High. Same. And here it says, Thou art my son, which is the same, well, in a sense, the same, um, the same, we we'll call it, speech we get made to David about Solomon, saying that I will be his father and he shall be my son. Yeah, see. Um, see, this day have I begotten thee, Ask of me, and I will give thee the Eden for thine inheritance, and the uttermost most parts of the earth for thy possession. See, and this is the promise where the Lord make unto the house, unto um, Israel, seen to Yahushai. Right, Yahushai is going to be the ultimate ruler. Seen. Right, the most high Yahweh is going to be the head of everything. Seen, then you're going to have Yahushai. Right? And Lord willing, if we are part of the elect, we're going to be joined here unto Yahweh Shai. Right? All that we are going to inherit the kingdom. See? So, yeah, hopefully this lesson was edifying. And again, brothers, um, if you have any, any of the other precepts, just drop them on the comment board. And until next time, hopefully, hope this lesson was edifying. Shalom.